non-federal citizens, and foreign residents. I would like to speak directly to you today concerning the coronavirus pandemic, which is rapidly spreading around the world. The spread of this virus represents the greatest threat to the health and well-being of the people of Liberia since the Ebola epidemic suffered by our country from 2014 to 2016. Let me assure you that government is taking every precaution and actions to protect our borders and port of entry. However, in spite of these arrangements, I regret to inform you that Liberia has recorded a confirmed case of the COVID-19 virus. The infected person is Mr. Nathaniel Blama, Executive Director of the Environmental Protection Agency, who arrived in Liberia on Brussels Airlines on Friday night, the 13th of March. Along with several other officials of government traveling on the same flight, Mr. Blama chose not to be quarantined in keeping with the health protocols that were in place at the airport. An intensive tracing exercise is on the way to identify and test all persons with whom he came into contact. Meanwhile, all other persons who travel on that flight and bypass the mandatory screening protocols are being made to report to the health authorities immediately and without any further delay for testing. Any other person who attempt to bypass screening at any port of entry will be arrested and taken into compulsory quarantine. I want to assure the Liberian people that the situation is under professional management by the health authorities, who have adequately prepared themselves well in advance for this eventuality. There is no need to panic. I ask that all of you should remain calm and report any suspicious medical behavior to the authority for our own safety. It is very important that we all follow the guidelines set out by the health authority and adapt our behavior accordingly. My fellow citizens, ladies and gentlemen, in view, in view of the above, it is necessary to take certain immediate actions in response to this threat. There must be a strong focus on hygiene from every individual and organization. Everyone should wash their hands often, several times a day, with soap and running water, and use hand sanitizers wherever available and available. All offices, businesses, schools, churches, and places of public gatherings should provide hand washing facilities at their entrances. There should be no handshaking whatsoever. Use a knob or your head for greeting each other. My impending national county tour is hereby postponed due to this new development on the coronavirus situation. All travels and from all countries with over 200 or more coronavirus cases are hereby banned. All citizens and residents are urged to avoid public gatherings and large crowds and try to keep a minimum social distance of at least six feet 
from people with fever, cough, sneezing, and difficulty in breathing. No essential travel by all officials of government is hereby banned. All non essential employees of the government are hereby granted a pay leave until further notice. The civil service agency will announce the roster of employees in this category. Minimize your travel within Liberia and to from abroad to that which is absolutely necessary. This refers especially to cross-border traders and travelers coming to Liberia from infected countries and apply particular to all government officials. As President, I will remain focused at the highest level of leadership and concern until this threat has been neutralized. However, as Liberia has now moved from the precautionary stage to the containment stage, we will need your fuller support and cooperation as you change your behavior to follow the simple guidelines and measures that have been recommended above. We will also be relying on the cooperation and support of our international partners as we work together to eliminate this deadly virus from our country. Please take note and govern yourselves accordingly. May God bless Liberia. May God bless you all. I thank you.